Want to get better at making content? Make more content. You want to get better on camera? Then you have to spend more time on camera. You want to be a better interviewer? Spend more time talking to people and interviewing them. I think you see where I'm going with this. We have known since we were little kids that the secret to getting good at things is to practice. You have to learn by doing. But like everything, uh, our procrastination, our worry about not being good enough, the fear of judgment keeps us from even starting anything. The biggest problem that we have is that we wanna be good at stuff right away. I took my son to a hockey game and he's watching these players just, they're destroying the other team. Like it's 7-0 at this hockey game and it is so much fun to watch our team crush the other team. And my son turns to me, he's eight, he turns to me afterwards and he goes, I wanna do hockey. He wants to play hockey like the professionals are playing hockey. But I had him in skating two years ago and he hated it. He hated everything about learning how to skate. Ah, but he wants to play hockey the way the professionals do. And so when I sit down with him, I say, if you wanna learn hockey, we have to start with skating. We're gonna fall, we're gonna get down. You hated that. Are you gonna work through it? Are you gonna try and get good at skating? And then you're gonna start getting good at stick handling and at drills and understanding your position? Mm, it's too much work, it's too scary. He's not really gonna do it. He doesn't want it that badly. And it's easy when you're talking about an eight-year-old kid to say, well, of course, they're looking at professionals, but they don't want it that badly. But you do the same thing. There are things that you are working towards and you feel like you're putting in a good amount of work, but you're bumping up against the fact that you wanna be good at things right away without being bad at them, without sucking, without embarrassing yourself, without falling down. Tony Robbins talks about the fact that every parent is watching their child learning how to walk, that child is gonna fall. Every little kid falls and tries and learns how to walk and guess what? We're all professional walkers now. We've all got it figured out, don't we? We're all pretty good at it. You know what you have to do, you just don't wanna do it. You're just too afraid to embarrass yourself or to suck or you're, you're worried that it's gonna just be too much work. You wanna be awesome at it right from the start, but you're not going to be. And as long as you are chasing the outcome, as long as my son is attached to the idea of becoming a professional hockey player, but he doesn't love skating, and he doesn't love the process of learning, and he doesn't wanna go into house league and then work up his way to AAA and then OHL and then the NHL. If he doesn't love that process, then he's never going to become a professional hockey player because it's not enough to want that thing. You have to love the process of chasing that thing and getting that thing and growing into that thing. So for everything that you wanna do, for your hopes, your dreams, your wealth, your business, your fitness, you can do anything. If you want it bad enough, if you love the process of it, and if you're willing to start as a newbie, if you're willing to start basic, no one is conspiring against you. People aren't keeping you from growing or learning or achieving all the things that you want to achieve. It is literally just you up here. It's your fear of sucking your fear of not being good enough. It's your fear of making a mistake. Put that aside and take action today on it and just love the fact that you suck at it. Like, like embrace how badly you are at it because here's what's awesome about starting things and being bad. Go back and watch my first video on this channel. It's really, really bad. But the reason I love how bad it is because I can go back and see how much I've progressed, how much better I am at what I'm doing. And in two years or three years, I'm gonna look back on what I'm doing right now and go, oh man, that's embarrassing how bad I am right now. But I love the process of learning. I love unlocking those little things that make me better at what I'm doing. And so the answer is really, really simple. You just have to stop waiting. You have to start starting and you have to be consistent. Month over month, year over year, you keep at it. Little by little, you will get everything that you want and you will get exactly what you need. If you wanna know what you can do to make yourself proud, check out this video right here. I think you'd love it a lot and I will see you there.